Thanks for tuning in to Me and My Golf TV and welcome to part one of the Queen's Course course vlog we did at Glen Eagles. Now Andy, what a great golf course. Fantastic golf course, part of our Scotland trip with golfbreaks.com. Lots of amazing courses we've played so far. Kings Barnes, Carnoustie, the Kittocks, the Torrens. Make sure you check those out. We've got a fantastic one lined up for you today. So I hope you enjoyed part one. Let's take charge of your game. Okay, Andy, we've got 437 yards, sixth hole. We've got bunkers down the right at 250. Bunkers, that big bunker there is 300 at the front of that, so it's not a driver. It's Two iron. iron. Keep it in play. It looks, it looks nice, doesn't it? This? Looks very nice. No wind at all. Beautiful. Might play well different style of golf for the Lynx golf we've been playing the last couple of days. It's Carnoustie, Kings Barnes, Torrance Kittix, make sure you check out those videos. Lots of fun and a few good shots. Just down the left side, unfortunately Andy's in the way. So just behind Andy there, left semi. Yes, or oh, tried to work back to the fairway. Yeah, ball feeds back in, doesn't it, from there? Got a yard off the fairway. Okay then, Pierce. Two iron. Slightly, slightly into that. You've got the lingo now. You've only been here three days. Can you? I think he was coming up with Callum, wasn't it, in the uh, in the buggy? Yeah. What a nice guy. Yes, and that's a corker. Straight down. Yeah, left hand side, very, very nice. Okay, that one. Good start. Very nice, first shot of the day. Okay, Andy. Difficult to see the flag. Blue flag we are on the Queen's course. 206 yards to the flag. Ball below. Straight at the flag, I think. Here. Yeah, straight at it. That bunker right doesn't look here. Yeah, that bunker is well short of the green, so it's not actually a green side bunker, more of a 50 yard pitch. Bunker. What are you going with, sorry? Going with a five iron here. Five iron, 206. Right at the flag. Come on. Come on. A little bit right side, that should be yep. fine there. On the green. Okay. Right and Pierce, good shot there. Thank you. 185 left of the flag. Calm yeah. as anything, no wind around. Nothing at all. A smooth little six here. Smooth six iron. Beautiful strike. Just coming down the left side, I think. Yeah, pitched on the top. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. Difficult to know, isn't it? What's that, what yeah, sort of yeah. what's behind it, really? Yeah, clear, really. So we we're just sort of guessing, but yeah, good shot. Thank you. Right, so Andy, little short, looked really good in the air. Obviously, uh, did go a little higher, so maybe spun it a little bit more than he wanted, height-wise. Bit of work to do here to save his par. If you haven't seen the other course logs, you'd have seen his short game has been pretty good form. Last few days. Different kind of proposition though now on the golf course. That is more of a parking course. You know what? Not bad. A little bit under hit. Haven't had a chance to get out onto the chipping green this morning, so we had an early start, so this is 7.30 in the morning. Chris got a pretty straightforward chip. It looks like he's got six or seven iron here. He's not really after any height, just get it over the, the fringe. Sounded like there's a bit of moisture between the face oh, and the ball on that one. Slow the hell. Um, left himself a little tricky par save. Okay, Pierce. See if you can roll this one in. Maybe a little bit further on that line. 
Cut that in, Andrew. Cut it in, yep. You carry on. That's not a very carry good start. On. After two good shots. Okay. Hmm. So a slightly downhill. Should be a little bit of left to right. Foxsters, they haven't turned as much. Oh, that's a distinctly average start. It was, but you know what? <laughs> please keep watching Put the rest of the. Shots. Please keep watching the rest of the course vlog. We will play that's better. Second shot. We should hit the green. That's Appleton. Mm. Blame you. I blame you. <laughs> right, Andy, after a bogey bogey start, or well, bogey from both of us, should I say, we need some birdies, please. We Luckily, do. we've got a 491 yard par 5. Downhill looks like it's dogleg to the left. We've got a big bunker there at 340. Bunker's all down the left, so we can hit driver at that bunker, and we should be fine. Straight down that stripe in the fairway, then. Yeah. Do you know what? Even though dog legs left, we don't need to shape it down the dog legs so we can go draw or fade here. And Andy's hit a little draw down the left. Just gonna be, just gonna, we'll see. I think that this should be, if you want, I, I, the trees, I, I have no, I have no idea whether that actually is in the bunker or not. So I don't know why I'm actually trying to think. No, no, it's over the bunker. Oh, yeah, oh, there's other ones there, isn't it? It might be left of that bunker. Right, Pierce. Okay, bit of room on the fairway there. Wide right? open fairway there now. The right. Gone down the right. Down right. Down towards, I don't know whether their bunkers are not down there. We'll soon find out. I think it's okay, it's just gonna be in the rough thing. Yeah. Nearly threw the club down there. I think I need a different glove on this one. But I think we should have had a warm up. Yeah. Warm up before we play. Make sure you do it, guys. Okay, Andy. 210 yards. There's the flag there. What is, that, what is that building in the distance? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm interested to find that. I was a little bit like just looking at that more than I think it's telling the story. Oh, it's too big to be a house. Okay, so two, twelve, and a six, five. I got a five iron. Five iron. Seeing your shorts. Yeah, yeah. Seeing it hitting. It had a lot of rain last night. I think. All right. Good right half. Is that okay? Did it draw back enough? Um, sort of, yeah, yeah. I didn't actually see it down. No, I didn't see it down. Heard it. I'm pretty sure it's on the green. <laughs> okay, Pierce? Yep, it's okay. It's it's pretty not thick lying here, too so. bad. Yeah, it's lying okay. 212 to the flag. Flag looks deep as well, so I'm just gonna hit I'm gonna six iron. Six iron, yeah. That out of that rough again, probably a bit of a flyer. Yeah, it's zero wind around, so it's a bit downhill as well. It's a bit downhill, isn't it? So it's not a full-on rip up. Look Middle of the green. Break. And that's starting down the right hand side. It's a good looking shot. Just day. almost there, just front, yeah? Ball hit the ground and stopped. I haven't been used <laughs> to that for the last two days at Kings Barnes and Carnoustie. In the Fairmont. Okay, so Pierce left himself with a um, a long putt here. About halfway in between him and the flag, there's a ridge, so as soon as he gets over that ridge, it's going to be all downhill to the flag. So he's just really got to get it at a pace that's going to be get to sort of halfway between him a little bit right to left and then it's going to break now it's going to pick up a little bit of pace not bad it's going to work a little bit towards us now yeah good effort from there he's left himself with an uphill putt about 10 feet but makeable very highland feel today with the the mist, early morning mist, high up in the 
hills. Beautiful scenery. Been very spot the last few days. So Andy, I'm pretty sure it's not going to come back. This is a lovely lag putt, but never threatened the line. Yeah, definitely was. Uh, definitely, if anything, was maybe a little left or right. Good birdie though. Good bounce good, back. Yes, definitely a good bounce back there. Okay, Pierce. Not much in this one then, really. Fairly straight. Looks good. Oh. Yes, right side. Okay, Andy, 337 yards, par for eighth. Bit of a blind landing area, so we need to be going over the bunker on the over right, the I believe. On the right, yeah, with a, with a three iron, so just again, put this one in play, really, if I can. Three iron over that bunker. Like it. iron over the bunker. Perfect. No point looking down there on that one for you guys because that's a good shot. Very nice. Okay Pierce. Yep. Three iron. <laughs> four iron. Four iron. Doesn't like his three guys. I do like my three. I just, four iron is the club. <laughs> He's lying. I don't dislike any of my clubs. They all work exceptionally well once a year. And great golf shot, a little left of mine, but Fine, a bit really good. Back. Sort of coming down to the left of that bunker. Good line in from there, I reckon. Really good, yeah. Looking at the planner. Nice. Okay, so Andy has got 126 left to that flag location. He's over here, there's a mound in the way, so we're not going to be able to uh, see that. So we'll see if we can give you a view from here. A gap wedge, pitching wedge maybe, a little wedge. Looks close. It took a big bounce left actually. Yeah, good shot. Right, nice shot there, Pierce. Thank you. 115 left. 115. Into that flag there. Sand wedge, 56. Good shot yours, then you just took a check left, a bounce left. Cake needs to spin oh. at the flag. Yeah, it's okay. He's right, right on the flag, on the line, right on the mark. Just a little clean off the bottom. I'm probably just trying to hit it a little hard, maybe, but yeah, should be fine. All right. So as you can see, we're both very sociable. Mr. Green, a bit too big there, but we've only got we've got a pretty straightforward chip. Well, doesn't it? So the first bounce on mine would have definitely been. A lot there we go, back up to that flag. Uphill now, so we can be a little bit more aggressive with this chip. Yeah. I'm sure it'll check a little bit as well. So Pierce has got 52 degree. He's been aggressive with it. Bit of a kick right, but. Perfect distance control. Okay, so as Indy says, very sociable we were then. Definitely gonna be a popular spot. A lot of people will be chipping down there going big and is look pretty good. Oh he's only hit the flag. He's only hit the blooming flag. How do you feel about that? You know what that was just in all the way. I thought how did that not go in? The flags are too thick here. <laughs> is, there, is there a limit on size of the flags? If you look at the flag closely, you'll see that it actually tapers down lower at the bottom. Okay. So, okay. unfortunately, that argument will not stand. Oh, you're having that then. Okay, Pierce. Yeah, right to left. Slightly downhill. Yeah. Uh, but no problem there at all. All right. Yep, good chip and put there. Thank you. We deserve pars on that one though. Yeah, good tee shots again. We're hitting the tee shots, not too bad. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed part one there about Glen Eagles course vlog. Massive thank you to Glen Eagles themselves 
What a fantastic facility they've got here in a golf course, which is beautiful. Beautiful. Also, thanks to our friends at golfbrace.com for making this happen. Guys, comment below. What do you think of the golf course? Have you played here? Would you like to play here? And also subscribe to the channel. Click the link below for more videos every week. Absolutely, guys. Now, if you want to see part two and see some even better golf, make sure you click on the link. Go to meandmygolf.com. And yes, we're going to get better, aren't we? Hopefully. Yes. Thanks for watching. Cheers.